Good morning, my friends. What up? Hey, we know what time it is. It's definitely time for a cup of coffee. Absolutely beautiful early morning, as you can see. What's your favorite activity? Um, and you know, if you become a couch potato and aren't doing much in the, in the way of activities, reflect back into your life a little bit and wonder and ask yourself, what, what did I used to like to do? Uh, I, I just came back in from taking the dog for a walk. I'm not going to tell you that's my favorite activity, but it does have the uh, the impact of getting me off the couch or off the chair or away from the computer. We got to go out and walk around with the dog, and so you know that's that's one thing. But I I still love the water ski. I'm an avid water skier. I love to snow ski. I love to hike and backpack. So from a physical activity viewpoint, oh, and I love to scuba dive. Uh, I'm a master diver. Now, you may not like to do those things. You may not like to water ski, or you may not be a scuba diver. But what is it that you like to do? What is it that would get you off the couch, away from the computer, out of the house, and get you doing something? Maybe you used to like to play basketball and you sort of stopped, or soccer, or baseball. Um, maybe the things that you used to like to do that you've stopped doing and that you could start to do again that would get you out of the house and give you something that you really enjoy doing and would really help you physically, mentally, and emotionally to survive this life of ours. Not that any of us survive it, but you know what I mean. Because when I say survive this life of ours, what I really mean is to live your life as as elegantly as you possibly can, with as much pleasure and with as much enthusiasm as you can muster. So what is it? What is it? What was it that you that you used to love to do that you've quit doing? And can you start again? Can you go do it again? Maybe not at the same level, maybe not at the same intensity. Maybe, maybe you used to play uh, football and you say, well, I can never go out and do that again. Well, yeah, you can. I mean, you can get a couple of buddies out and go toss a football around. Maybe you don't have to go play tackle. I don't know. You know, so, but it's so important as we age that we keep our body moving and keep getting exercise. It helps our lungs. It helps our heart. It helps our digestive system. Uh, it helps prevent diabetes, heart attacks, strokes. It helps prevent uh, arthritis, keep our joints moving. There's so many things that physical activity helps. So get some today. Go do something. Go do something that your future body is going to thank you for. You're going to be happy about it. It's going to put its arms around you and say, that was a good thing to do. All right, my friends, you have a wonderful day. And be compassionate. The world needs a whole lot more of that. If you're in the United States, we're six days away from the election. This is going to be one roller coaster ride. Uh, love your neighbor. No matter what your neighbor believes, love your neighbor for what they are. Remember, they're human beings with an opinion. And we live in a country where one of the remarkable th freedoms we have is the right to have our own opinion. All right, my friends, be compassionate. We'll talk again tomorrow. Bye for now.